All right, so here is the high aspect wing that the other build videos were based off of. And I've been on this wing a few times now and I hope to be on it more and get more footage. It's, it's hard to get all the people lined up to do that, but uh, this thing's great. It definitely meets the goals that I wanted it to meet. It's more efficient, easier to pump. It can hang back. So my friend's boat, doesn't really throw a huge wake. This one can hang back pretty far back on the second wake, which other wing designs couldn't. Uh, this is way more efficient when you pump and you can just feel it's much more, has much more glide to it. It definitely does what I wanted it to do. Now this is the, I think it was 1150 millimeter uh, wingspan, which is rather large. I'm definitely gonna come out with some some smaller ones and potentially one even even bigger but yeah so far this thing is it's, it's really been great so one thing that was a little bit of a concern with this wing was okay yeah i have that plywood core in there and i'm very familiar with that um what kind of stiffness are we going to get out of this and as you know, we've seen the build, I went with carbon fiber. And I went with what mm, I would think, I kind of just went with, you know, I think this will be an acceptable layup. And I think what I used definitely was, I can't remember what it was off the top of my head, but I have it written down. When these make it to the site, obviously that layup will be uh, there. So people know what to do. And my next uh, idea or my next goal is to cut out a few more of these cores and see what see if it's possible with fiberglass. If it, I believe it would be, it would just be you'd have to use a much heavier layup, which would um, be a thicker composite skin, which would maybe make the wing a millimeter and a half, two millimeters thicker than say a carbon layup. So it would change the performance of the wing, I guess a little bit, how much you'd notice, I, I, I don't really know. But I'm curious to see if glass can be done. I actually believe it definitely can be, it's just a matter of how much. So I just wanna kind of demonstrate the stiffness that we have here. And so I'm using these, just some blocks of wood here just to get the wing up off the ground. And I mean, it's this isn't a really scientific thing here, but uh, I'm just kind of imagining, or I'm just trying to place these blocks, like the center of lift where I think each side of the wing would be. Because obviously all this surface is lifting, all of this surface is lifting. So probably somewhere around here is where that where we can kind of uh, approximate like this full wing lifting in the water. So I think this gives it a relatively fair representation, even though it's not exactly how it is in the water, but it'll give us a basic idea. Okay, so we have the wing up on the blocks and a nice background there to hopefully even everything out. I'm just gonna stand on the center part of it, kind of bounce around a little bit. I'm about 190 pounds, 180 eight-ish so certainly doesn't feel like there's much give in it I mean you can definitely see it flexing a little bit but nothing nothing out of control especially given the layup I went with I, I would say it's a pretty light layup so you could definitely add way more carbon in more strategic areas and get a way stiffer result, but uh, this is pretty stiff as is. Okay, so I know that was really basic, very rudimentary, but just gives us an idea of what we're working with. And I'll hopefully be able to compare that footage with say this exact same core, but with say 100% fiberglass, see where we're at, kind of get a baseline, but definitely, Definitely very possible and very doable. Clearly, I mean, this one's worked out well. And it's good to keep in mind this is a rather large span uh, for a high aspect wing. Definitely can push it a little bit further and still keep that stiffness that's needed.
but I think on some of those shorter span wings, obviously your stiffness is just gonna increase even more. So, so far so good. The high aspects is turning out pretty well. So I, I'm excited to get the other sizes done and then also compare carbon versus glass, what the difference will be there.